if you want to live any addiction yes yeah so i am basically a pure being and i see myself as that i visualize myself as that as a pure being this is impurity so when i visualize myself as the pure being and i give get the sakash to that form then definitely these things will not pull me yeah. yes for somebody else also they would have to take this thought i am a pure being if they don't think even though if i give sakash it is going to that impurity only so so baba says you have to have good wishes and pure feelings good vibrations that is your help if you are giving them sakash you are giving sakash to what to the soul you are not giving sakash to the even to the soul but the soul will become more powerful in taking that alcohol that is why i said good wishes and pure feelings good vibrations have a thought this person comes back to his beautiful nature that's all unless and until he tries himself it is not going to help he should also have the desire no? he wants it but he, he said so I'm we can trying, we trying. can guide him if he wants then we can guide him you sit with me in meditation time at morning hours and just think you are a pure soul i do it is his karma you cannot interfere with his karma you know everybody has their own karmic accounts what we try to do we try to we want we want them to improve you we want them to be nice mm -hmm. we want them to give up that addiction yes but their karmic accounts are also we cannot interfere with their karmic accounts but our sakas can help right yeah but where is it going <laughs> the sakash is making him more powerful to drink yeah that is why the good wishes the good wishes and good thoughts we can just so the sakash if i am saying you know baba is giving power to your pure being you are a pure being is that is that not the right way to give the sakash then to yeah, empower we to the visualize him in his original form that is okay but still if uh, subconsciously also we think that he is addicted it's not going to help him sakash has seven things it is just like with jior you know you pass the white light from the prism and there are seven colors when those seven colors merged in one that is white light isn't it so sakash is like that that white light which has seven things merged in it all attainments all powers all virtues all treasures all blessings and complete purity yes this seven things is sakash so sakash is very powerful ha huh? that is why sakash is for ourselves we are receiving sakash from baba we are receiving all this yes. that sakash is the seven colors of the values the seven colors of the soul happiness purity love uh, uh, that we can give like yeah that we can give the seven values that that web jior we can give no sakash is for the self we take sakash from baba in that these are these seven powerful things once i had 
um, I was sitting with Dadi Kulsar and I asked her, Dadi, what is the difference between Sakash and yoga power? So that is when she said, in Sakash, there are the seven things. Watch. Nobody has seen, but Baba has clarified you through the Murlis what Satyug is like. And we are able to see ourselves in that divine form. Nobody has seen Satyug. Only the initial stage when people had visions of golden age, they only saw. But on the basis of understanding through Baba's Murlis, through the third eye, we have all visualized what golden age is like. We have seen the images, although those images are not perfect. Many a times Baba says the image of Lakshmi and Narayan, Radhe and Krishna, they are not perfect, but still they are, they are divine. We can see some divinity in them. They are more beautiful than that. So we have to visualize that. On the basis of knowledge, understanding, we understand what the golden age is. Baba's avyakta murlis, how the food will be there, how the lifestyle will be there, how the, hmm, how the routine would be there. Everything Baba has mentioned. So that is why the cleanliness, I was talking about the cleanliness. You need to clean the soul on the basis of understanding. That purity has to be imbibed. Every day, Murli, what are we doing? Cleaning the soul. And when the cleanliness is there, then the yoga can be established. When that purity is there, when we are holy, we are able to have yoga with Baba. If I am able to be holy, pure, if I am able to surrender myself to Baba, holy, yeah, and if I am able to do past is past, putting a full stop, do not going on and on and on over those thoughts, then definitely we'll see the change. The yoga is there. And in that yoga, the more I'm able to stabilize myself in the seed stage, that, is, has, that has all the potential and it will burn your past karmas also. In Sakash, all powers, all virtues, all blessings, all attainments, all treasures, happiness from all relationships, and complete purity. Sarva Shaktiya, Sarva Gun, Sarva Vardhan, Sarva Khazane, Sarva Prapti, Sarva Sukh, Sarva Sambandho Ka Sukh, and complete purity, Sampurna Pavitrata. Om Shanti. Yes. Uh, sorry, lastly, regarding Sakash, I want to share something. I had a big time realization many years back when I saw one of my closest family relations, a uh, Brahmin sister, trying to change her husband, like doing hours and hours of meditation just because her Brahmin life uh, becomes easier. So then I realized, what is the point? Baba says, transform yourself. If we are expecting somebody to transform, change themselves, just because that will make our life easier, that is not what Baba actually means. Yes. So then I realized whenever I, when I had like uh, job issues, I was not being able to find a, an expected job and some issues here and there, visa issues and things. And then uh, I thought I should, do yoga for myself so that yes. I stay unaffected no matter what because Baba did not come to the earth to grant me visa, right? Yes. So, yes. yes. It's so very true, very true. The idea of Sakash is we stay uninfluenced and unaffected. Mm -hmm. So, we need more Sakash more than any other person or the nature of the Yes. Earth. Thank you. Instead of changing others because that will take a lot of time, Waste your time because that person does not have the desire and they don't want to change. And you are just putting, so it is just going there, hitting back and coming and you're wasting your time. You're not using that Sakash for the self. Your Sakash is also wasted. And that may bring 
doubts in Baba also. Yes, yes. Why? The, it is only this birth that that relation is there. Not for all these births. So why that attachment? Be a detached observer and do not interfere with his karma. Because you are not going to get results. The moment I gather the strength in me, maybe your strength will gradually affect him. In your company, in that, when you are radiating that purity in the house, or when you are radiating, that person would not feel like drinking there in that pure atmosphere. So let me inculcate that purity and radiate that vibrations in the house, and the person will not feel like drinking in that pure house. It would repel him. He will go out and drink and do whatever. So why waste your energy on somebody and you are interfering with his karmic accounts? Have good wishes, pure feelings that he should change. But let me take Sakash for myself and radiate that Sakash in the whole home. Clean, pure, clean the vibrations. And when we clean the vibrations, maybe. There is another way one sister shared her experience with me. That she saw that her husband was constantly drinking. So now what to do? So whenever she cooked the food, she used to put those thoughts in it. Whenever this person is going to drink on, on this pure food, he would have vomits. He should have vomits. So every time then she started seeing that when he used to eat the food, he started vomiting. And then he started, what is it? Why am I vomiting? Is this because of the food or something? Then he stopped eating the food also. But whenever he used to drink, he used to start vomiting. And then he realized, I think something is getting wrong. And he had to give up. Finally, he had to give up. And that lady shared this experience. I always had, whenever he drinks, he has to vomit. Whenever he drinks, he has to vomit. No matter I have to clean up, doesn't matter, I'll clean. But he has to vomit. So he, she constantly gave those vibrations. And then he started vomiting. vomiting. And every time you drink, he would. And it would make him feel so uneasy that he gave up drinking.